uh, Dustin. Armand, obviously, you guys uh, came into this one knowing they were going to be uh, difficult to deal with on the bounce and in transition. Obviously, they were able to get a lot of points that way. Just, uh, just what made them so tough to deal with in, on both in both of those facets? Um, yeah, we came into the game knowing this was a guard the ball game for us. Um, I think their guards they did a good job of penetrating the paint. You know, getting looks for themselves and then getting looks for their teammates. So uh, uh, we just got to be better on on the ball defense. Tom. Armand, you guys did a nice job of battling back into the game and uh, got it down basically to one possession. Uh, uh, did you like what you guys were getting for looks uh, down the stretch there? Um, yeah, uh, I think we got some good looks. Uh, unfortunately, some of them didn't go down, but, you know, when we made our runs, uh, they they came back with some big plays and we weren't able to match them. And obviously, they, you see they played more desperate than we did. We just got to pick it up for the next one. Alex. I'm good, JD. I, I, my question's for Archie. Jeff. Hey, Armand. What do you feel the biggest issue is for you guys kind of getting some consistency as far as you beat number four Iowa, then lose at home to an unranked team? You know, last year, beat Florida State, then, have, you know, there are losses that follow big wins. What, what do you feel is keeping you guys from getting some momentum? Um, in this league, I don't think it's anything about momentum. It's just you play a good team every night. Um, you know, some games go your way, some games don't. Uh, ball bounces your way, sometimes it don't. So I think this one just didn't bounce our way, and they uh, they made enough plays at the end for for themselves to uh, put themselves in position to win. Armand, how, how tough was it to get uh, Trace established today? Uh, in particular, you know, they, they kind of flash some doubles in the post, and even Miles Johnson, it seemed like when you fed him inside, he was, he was kind of poking it away. What, and how did that impact the offense? Well, we knew Miles Johnson. He's a, he's a big puzzle player, and we know he has good hands and likes to reach around and can get steel. So it's, it's always tough trying to feed Trace the ball just because he garners so much attention and uh, he's a dominant player. So uh, it's just – we just have to find different ways, you know, try to get him the ball, and then gosh, just got to put it in there. Last question, Pegram. Armand, uh, I think they, I think you guys only shot 35% on twos and 63% on threes. Just was it their size inside that was causing trouble finishing, or were you not getting the kind of shots you wanted there? And they have good size. I mean, at the end of the day, we just when we get to the rim, we just got to lock in and concentrate. We got to focus in, you know, take our time to finish. Greg, did you have a question? Yes, please. Yeah, Armand, I've got I've got two real quick. One is you looked like you hurt your ankle. You stepped on the guy's foot. You looked hurt, and the rest of the game, you anyway. Are you okay? You didn't look quite hundred uh, percent. I'll be fine. I mean, yeah, stepped on the guy's foot. Okay. Walk it off. Get treatment. Okay, last thing is you guys were in there for quite a while uh, before coming out here to speak to us. What was it, What's it like in there? I'm, I'm guessing Archie's upset. You guys are upset. What's the mood? Uh, we're just disappointed for each other. Uh, you know, we're putting the work all last week, all this week. You know, and you're putting that much work and you work so hard. You know, uh, it's just you know, you're not finding a buzzer ring and you're not winning. You don't win. It's just everybody's upset. Uh, so... You know, we just take this and move forward to the next one. Thanks. All right, thanks, everyone.